Hi, welcome back to the Pool Butler YouTube channel. In this video, we're going to spotlight one of our most recent blog posts. So, without further ado, Robert, take it away. Thanks, Jennifer, and thank you for watching our video about Is Swimming in Chlorine Safe? Chemicals such as chlorine and bromine are added to pools to keep the water clean. The biggest benefit of chlorine is that it kills germs that may be present in the water. If a pool were left unchlorinated, it would become a petri dish full of all sorts of harmful bacteria. For that reason, all public pools and most private pools are treated with some amount of chlorine. Swimming in an unchlorinated pool would expose a swimmer to a whole host of potentially harmful bacteria, so the benefits of chlorine definitely seem to outweigh the risks. Undiluted chlorine would be poisonous if ingested, but in small amounts diluted in water, chlorine poses little risk. In fact, chlorine is added to drinking water to kill bacteria and make it safe to drink. The EPA regulates the amount of chlorine in drinking water. You can read the full blog post entitled, Is Swimming in Chlorine Safe? on our website at thepoolbutler.com. We have a link directly to this post under the video in the description box. In addition to our blog, be sure to check out the rest of the Pool Butler website. We have over six sections dedicated to helping you learn more about us and why we are the absolute best choice for all of your swimming pool maintenance, cleaning, and repair needs in Atlanta. Do you have swimming pool questions? No problem. On our website, you will find tons of answers, customer testimonials, our contact information, and multiple pages that highlight the swimming pool services we offer, including eco-friendly solutions. After visiting us online, email or call us directly, and we will be happy to answer any swimming pool questions you might have. Learn more about why The Pool Butler is the ideal company for your swimming pool needs on our website at thepoolbutler.net. And finally, make sure to check out the description box below this video, where there's a lot more information, including links to our website and social profiles. Thanks for watching, and now let's take it back to Jennifer. Thanks, Robert. Now it's your turn. If you like this video, click on the thumbs up icon and on the subscribe button below this video. After that, make sure to check out the description box where there's a lot more information, including links to our website and social profiles.